I don't know what I did, but I broke the center block and it released a lot of numbers. Looks like they all dropped snowballs. I have no idea what's going on. What's chilling to this strawberry here? And I was just exploring a little bit of the vault while I was waiting for some sugar cane to grow. And... I don't know, there's just a lot of numbers flying around. Okay, so I'm just breaking this glass. I don't know. Okay, okay. So I guess we're breaking the glass and we're... This is weird. I guess I'm trying to figure out what number is missing. Zero, one, two, three, four. Unless I'm trying to figure out how many there are around here. Four, five. I'm looking at the green. Five, six. This is weird. Seven, eight. Zero, nine. Green, nine. Uh. These are all bats, definitely. There's a green 9. Okay, so I think 10. Okay, I have no idea. <laughs> Let's um try again. 0, 1, 2... I have no idea what down below is for. So I was trying to read through these books and try and find out what that underground vault's for. I didn't really find anything, but there was one of these books. I think it was this one. Oh, so this one it says, um, writing this down so I do not forget, once I am able to resurface I need to head back southeast to escape this place, I think this is more adventuring than I would need in a lifetime. I think that means, uh, if I ra run over here, that block over there, I think that's what the gives us the achievement of adventuring time. I think so. Uh, there are two other books, we're gonna quickly read them as well. There are like five books which give me some stuff. This one here says, Some evenings I see a figure on top of the ice bike to the east. Uh, I think that might be the... Um, the skeleton achievement. Maybe. We'll have a look. This one says, um, uh, I was stuck in a never-ending minecart roller coaster. It went on for over a thousand blocks round and round. So I might try even... Uh, that's what I built this over here for. Um, I'm gonna try and go around in a mine track cart, see whether that's gonna give me the, the achievement for going a thousand block. But let's, um, these are the ice blocks to the east. I haven't seen anything yet. Let's see if we can see something right now. I don't see anything. There's a little hole there. I think it's see a dusk. I might have missed uh, the opportunity to see it. Hmm. I'll read that book again. Oh, was that one, right? Yeah, some evenings at dusk. Ah, oh, I'm gonna have to wait again. Alright, I'll be back. Oh! Whoa! Whoa! I was reading a book! Whoa! <laughs> Did I get it? Hold on, let's see. Hey! Got it! That's cool that the developers put that in. Oh, stop, stop. <laughs> stop. Well, I can put it like that anyway. Cool! We got that achievement at least. That's one less thing to worry about. And all of this is now unlocked. Can I go up there yet? Ooh! Wait, I can go up to this chest, I think. Let's have a look at what's up here. Chest. Yeah, chest. Ooh, emerald elytra. Got some elytra. Sweet. Gonna light that there. And uh yeah no, that's uh that needs lighting too. Cool. Um hmm. So yeah, I guess we're gonna have to wait till dusk and then once we've got the bookshelf and then we've got the, uh, hopefully we get that sk sniper door achievement, then we'll actually head over to the end. Alright, I've got enough paper for eight books, so... Which one? I think that should be enough for two bookcases, which will be an achievement. Yes! Achievement! Boom! Bada boom! On our enchantment table. Oh yeah, I've got some chickens by the way. I had some eggs and um... I just decided to throw some in, now we have like chickens in our little storage room. Yes! Achievement though! 
going through up to there. Alright, and it's just getting dark as well. So, I feel like we might only have a brief moment of time for dusk. Let's get up here. Hopefully not get knocked down by any random mob. Ooh, should I go... Maybe I should go over here. If the... If this is going to be sniper duel, for, then maybe I should be all the way... Uh, not all the way back, but like a little bit further back than just the border. Although this will be really hard to see. I'm looking at that there to see whether there's going to be a skeleton. Skeleton. There we go. Nope. That was terrible. Let's be quick. Oof. Oh, come on. Oh. Oh, come on. Yes! That's another achievement. <laughs> I'm glad I actually read those books. <laughs> oh jeez, I think also Alpha might have left a comment. Honestly, uh, Alpha, thank you for your comment. I didn't read it too much. You left a comment on the previous episode about the ice spikes. Um, I didn't remember that. I didn't really want to remember too much about it because I wanted to figure out a lot of this on my own. Cool beans, that's another chest. There is going to be some spawning spaces over there. And there is my pillar I need to take down uh, but with that that's another two achievements and I think the only viable now uh, ones now are either going to be overkill or the end so it'll be time to reach the end then which means I probably no my arrows I think I should have enough arrows yeah let me just get ready for the end and I'll be back in a second Okay, I have no idea what's going on at all, but I came back because in one of those books we were reading, it said putting water down throws like the water bucket or something. So I just decided to put the water down, but any of the bats which touch any of the water are apparently all freezing or something to death. Maybe this means that whatever bat is left behind, uh, all the bats which are left behind would me be all of the um the remaining numbers hmm we'll see how this goes i i'm all ready for the end though we'll do that in this episode as well or if i run out of time then obviously it'll be in the next part you'll know about it though i don't know about it i don't know how long this is gonna take i'm recording this live we're doing it live all right a bit more water uh <laughs> Yes! Okay, got the four. What did that do? I feel like that did nothing. What's the point of doing all of that for all the bats? Uh, no clue. Yeah, I have no clue, no idea what any of that meant. Um... I read in a book you're meant to snowball white stuff. What? What? I don't understand what that's meant to be about. I'm scared about all of us. I'm just gonna move on. Let's go to the end. The end is just a, a more familiar thing, but I haven't um, faced the Ender Dragon in a bit. So we're gonna. Face the Ender Dragon, I've seen a few of the uh, Ender Dragon boss fights, but I haven't particularly faced it. I brought all my iron stuff, just so I don't really need to worry about losing anything. So I've got my iron armor, I've got an iron sword with... I enchanted a few bows and combined them all into a power 3 bow with a stack of a bit of arrows. I've got some water, got some snowballs, and I've got 
some ender pills for the end island. I got some blocks. I think I should be ready. Let's get these in. Let's get the achievement. I'm actually a little scared. I completely forgot the other end. <laughs> I'll be back. I need to get the other ender pearl eye. <sighs> I should not be doing this at 1.30 a.m. In. God damn it. Okay, 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 okay. There are lots of blocks. Ender dragons there. Okay, I am a little nervous. Why are there ender pearls? And there all of those blocks over there. They've made this a little bit easier. <laughs> okay, hey man. How are you doing? Uh Sup. <laughs> Uh, looks like there are no endermen around. Okay. okay, that's what the red tint means. It means that we are outside the world border, which means we can't place any blocks. Uh huh. Right, well, you stay over there, mate. Yes! <laughs> Whoa, uh oh. I saw some of the stuff about Dragon Breath. Uh huh. Uh, no. Please don't hit me. Yes, that's another. Uh oh. I have no idea what that was. Oh, uh, that's Dragon Breath. Okay. This is the first time ever doing it. Oh. Damn. Alright, we have to watch out a little bit for the Ender Dragon as well. Uh, they broke a little bit into there. Made it look really cool and whatnot. Right, let's pull the, out the bow. Whoa. Okay, um, firing my bow there does not do anything. We have to be really careful about this. Whoa! Okay, there's another. Boop. That dragon is firing dragon breath everywhere. Uh, there's a um, crystal up there. Uh oh, I missed that one. Still missed that one. Ow! Did I get it? I can't tell. Isn't that great? I'm gonna assume... Maybe. Whoa! Let's stay away from there. Okay, there's one up there. We can get rid of that one. No, that's not gotten rid of. Yes, got it! Okay, what else do you have? That one's gone, that one's gone. That one's still there. Yes! Whoa! Uh oh! Whoa! Whoa! Hey man, uh, it's actually a little bit scary looking at the guy. I don't think I've ever done an ender fight by myself. Maybe I did it in Captain Minecraft 3. Okay, we'll get rid of that one because I can see that one's active. Oh, don't want to... Ow! Rude. Okay, that's gone. Whoa, uh-oh, whoa, whoa! We have, have to keep on two places at uh, keep track of two places at once. <laughs> Woo! Uh, we are gonna have to climb that one at least. Oh no! Um, yeah, okay, there's one over there. Hey man! Oh girl, I think it's a girl, right? It's an Ender Dragon girl. Boop. Nope. Boop. Nope. Come on! I can't see you! Uh oh! Whoa! Ow! Rude! Probably should have brought a potion or something. Okay, that crystal is still there. Whoa! Oh! Oh! I should not have flicked to my sword. I will need to flick between my snowball and the bow. Stay away! Stay away! Stay away, please. I don't like you. Uh, come on. I just want to get rid of that one. A little bit higher. Yes, got it. Cool. Uh oh. Where's the dragon? I don't know where the dragon is. Run! Okay, there you are. Hey, girl. Hello. What else do you have? Uh oh. Just that one there. Get it! No! Okay, too high. <laughs> I don't want to climb up there. That's a little scary, ain't it? 
Ow! What did I run into? I actually can't see it. Oh, did I get it? I think I got it. Whoa! Uh-oh. I think that's all of the towers now. Okay, so I have... Uh, I just still have all of my arrows, really. Didn't really use too many. So, in the dragon fight. I've not done too many of these, so this is all new and fascinating. I've never really wanted to. Okay. Hit you. This is going to be a game... Okay. Well, you're invulnerable standing there. <sighs> Fly away. Fly away, please. 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 We're, we're getting nowhere. Whoop. Boop. Ow. Rude. Alright, you want to go and get some sugar puff? I really don't have t enough arrows for this. Whoa! Whoa! This, dra this is going to take forever, isn't it? Unless I use my snowballs. Snowballs really don't do enough damage, though. That's why I brought a power of three. I didn't particularly want to use a regular bow. Whoa! That scared me a little bit. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's gonna take a while. As far as boss fights go, this was pretty long drawn. Pretty much just wait here, uh, wait for the dragon to reach the fountain, uh, go going for a swooping attack, and then he'd fly around a bit, shoot some dragon breath at me, and then he'd fly away, go back to the fountain, repeat a swooping flight. I was more worried about uh, my arrows than anything. <sighs> that was about, what, 15 minutes or so? That took a little bit of time. But at least we got a lot of XP. And that's the end fight complete. I think the uh, major thing we needed was the um, arrows, honestly. Just make sure, sure we had enough arrows. Alright, let's jump in here. Should be the other achievement. I can't place anything, can I? Yeah, no, because we're still outside the world border. Anyway. Boop. Achievements. I'm skipping the credits. And that's another achievement. Yes. We're up to here now. Alright, there's uh, some emeralds. Some gold nuggets. Some uh, shrimp. Didn't even need shrimp. And this was the block which meant... Um, what was it? Adventuring time. Wasn't it? Why did it indicate? Oh, walk on that block and get it. That's another achievement. Oh my god, we did so many achievements this episode. Alright, so what have we done? We've done all of this block. We need to get overkill. Oh, that would be what the Bane of Arthropods gold sword is for, wouldn't it be? Alright, I think there's just one more thing I want to do for this episode, and that is get that overkill achievement. This episode has probably gone on pretty long already, but we uh, might as well. Oh, I've got the dragon egg, and the dragon egg too. Ayo! Alright, back in a second. Okay, first things first, while I was caving, or just like searching random chests, I found some more emeralds, and I found some emerald ore, which would be enough for three blocks of emeralds. So we'll chuck this on the monuments. I want to see what this completes, because we're going to be completing the full hall of monuments, really. We don't need these emeralds for anything, I don't think. So, let's complete the hall of monuments. Okay, that's the uh, Hall of Monuments done. Yep, that's Hall of Monuments. And... Oh! Hey, I've already got villagers in here! Huh. I, um... Congratulations, you completed all the monuments. As a bonus reward, you get one of each type of monument block. Oh! Cool! That's pretty cool. Um, do these guys offer anything good? Like any specific reason these are my villagers? Or are these just random villagers? They might just be random village, Random villagers. Yeah, I think they're just random villagers. Oh well. Well, they are all living in my house now, so um, try not to die or anything. That'd be a little bit unfortunate. Let's chuck all of those back in. 
boop, 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 and all of you guys in there. You can stand there. Cool. Uh, what I was doing, I wanted to use my brewing stand over here. I left over here. I want to go strengthen you up, and we need to get this because I went down to the fortress and I tried taking a silverfish out with this Bane of Arthropod 5 sword. Except it didn't really work, so I'm thinking best way to remedy this probably strengthen it with a glowstone. Like, oh, doesn't need oh, it needs blaze powder, don't you? Oh dear. Oh, do I have any blaze powder? Oh, tell me I have blaze powder. I don't think I have blaze powder. Oh no. I think I used all of it up. Ugh. Back in a second. Alright, here we go. Alright, Bane of Arthropod Strength 2. Overkill, please. Yes! That's overkill right there. That's the last doable achievement, I think. <sighs> we are very nearing the end. This is taking a lot less time than I would have expected. Alright, so with achievements, that would be all of this done. And what's left is the wither and the beacon. Uh. Well, two more episodes to go. We've got to find out how to get more wither skulls. Wither skulls, hmm, that'll be interesting because I've only have, I've only found one wither skull so far, so I'm gonna have to go a little bit exploring all over the map, really, trying to find some more wither skulls. Hmm. Well, we'll have to see. But that's gonna do it for this episode or these two episodes or whatever I did for these. Did a lot. Did a dang lot. But. We are near, very nearing the end of Captive Minecraft 4. I hope you guys have enjoyed my series a bit. And I hope you guys are looking forward to the finale. I feel like I probably won't do the beacon. <laughs> I might, depending, seeing um, what the map makers do for me. If I have to get them all on my own, then probably not. If, I'd, if I have to make my own iron farm, then probably not. But yeah, that's going to do it for this episode or episodes. I hope you guys enjoyed. Cheers for watching, guys. And I will see you guys on the next episode of Captain Minecraft 4. Thanks for watching, guys. Catch you guys next time. Bye.